<clears throat> I haven't done a Chevy Talks in a while. life got kind of crazy for a second but because life got crazy I learned the valuable lesson of what it truly means when people say like home is where the heart is um my sister and I went to Target the other day and this is after the lesson has sort of kicked in and I got this cup called home. it says home sweet home and I'm walking past it and I was like I like that cup and like I said I had just come out of this energy of understanding that I am the constant that home is wherever I am and the reason why home is such a big topic right now because I um I ended up getting kicked out of my apartment and then um I was staying with a friend and I, I was just everywhere sleeping on the couch and then I decided to move back home but half of my stuff is in storage half of my stuff is that it's just like no roots okay um it seemed as though my root chakra had been all fucked up but just saying it like that the chakra systems is within your body the root chakra is something that anchors you to this world to this plane of existence something that's happening outside of me shouldn't have that much effect on me to where i feel shaken up to where i feel as though my uh, energy vortexes are broken no one or thing outside of you should have that much control over you to where you now feel icky and gross inside I bought this cup as a reminder to myself because you know I'm at home I like to drink tea and, and I didn't have any cups of my own all of my stuff I and I love tea like it's it's a it's a ritual for me so like not having a mug using somebody else's mug that it bothered me and I I guess I can speak on that because I speak so clearly on it because I have been tuning into my emotions I knew exactly how I felt you want you're upset over a damn guy sure the fuck am upset over not having cups that are not mine so realizing and, and I was upset not that I was home at home I, I was just upset that you know I didn't have my things I'm a Taurus I like value stability I have this sort of possessive qual uh, aspect when it comes to my things things that make me feel at home making my home nice was my thing comfortability and I felt as though my comfortability had been shaken up snatched away from me no one should ever feel like that Oop. so after meditating um all last week like i tell I, I tell you guys before um usually it takes me about seven days to get through a lesson and if longer then it's like we need we got we got more work to do but last week i basically was meditating and you know coming to terms with and truly understanding what it meant to be the constant in your reality everything outside you might change but you're the constant because you're the player you're not the environment you're not the game you're not the level and so learning that I sort of seem to soothe myself back into a balanced state when realizing that I shouldn't be looking outside of myself for safety, stability, foundation. I can build that within me. I did build that within me. That's what my YouTube's about, my TikTok. That's what you see me now. I built that in me to where I am the home. So getting this cup a couple days ago and being able to drink out of it every morning clean it it's it's like a ritual it's become a ritual like me cleaning my cup this is me physically taking care of my body taking care of my home it's just a, a cool little thing that I can do in my external reality that means so much to me or that means so much on a deeper level you but you know what I'm saying I don't know no I do know and I hope that by me speaking about this, it, it sort of helps anybody that's in a state where they feel alone 
they feel lost, out of place. You are the constant. Home is always here. And I think that when you start to realize that, when you start to act on that and, and remember that and keep that structured in your brain, the brain snapses in your brain, connect, and they start to build that foundation to where you don't doubt that, that thought, that truth. Home is where the heart is, and right now we are being led to act from the heart. Act from a more divine, feminine acts, aspect, aspects, whatever. And I think the first step, obviously, love yourself and everything else, you know, will come after. That was a message for myself. Everything's going to be okay. Bye.